Hello and welcome back to 100 Coding Challenges in C Sharp. This is episode 6 and it's called Holiday Spending. In this challenge we're going to write a program to calculate how much money is spent on this user's holiday. You want to start by asking the user what their starting budget is, then proceed to ask them how much was spent on food, how much was spent on trips, how much was spent on presents, and then tell them how much they have left. If you want to attempt this by yourself then hit that pause button now and it will begin. Okay, so what we're going to do first of all is ask the user what their starting budget is. We can store this into a decimal variable. I'm going to call this money left. And I'm going to take that input and convert it into a decimal. There we go. That should take the user's input and convert it into a decimal and store it in this money left variable. The next bit should be fairly straightforward so ask the user how much was spent on food. A shortcut to duplicate lines in Visual Studio is by hitting Control D so if we do that twice we can actually just get these out. So if I just change this to trips this one presence so now I've got my three console dot right lines but firstly before I ask all of these in between them I want to take their input and do the calculation so I'm still going to be using the same variable money left each time however I'm going to say money left equals money left minus the user's input So this is actually the same thing I can do each time. However, for the last one, we're going to do something a little bit different. We're still going to say money left. However, we're going to do minus equals the input from the user. Um, so what that will actually do is the same thing as there, but it will just take that knowing that I am minusing this value from the value that's already in this variable and then assigning it back to that variable. So now all we need to do is output this back to the user. So your remaining balance is um, money left. Uh, we can put a pound sign there if we want. So if we go ahead and run that, we say what was your starting budget. So let's say for example our starting budget was 5,000 and I spent 2,000 on food um, <laughs> and let's say another 2,000 on trips and then I spent 500 on presents because I don't like anyone apparently. Um, yeah, it would tell me that my remaining balance is 500 pounds. So that was a very simple, easy challenge. Just wanted to showcase the minus operator and also using um, this operation here. But yeah, this is the last episode in the basic section. From next episode onwards, we'll be going through selection. So make sure to stick around for that. If you enjoyed this video, then make sure to hit that like button and subscribe to see more videos like this. And I'll see you guys in the next one.